Hey, what's up guys? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Stephanie and today I'm going to be talking all about week 13 of this pregnancy so far. I did officially decide I'm going to do weekly updates. I am currently in my 14th week, so you guys will always be a week behind on these updates just because I would like to experience the full week before talking about my experience with the full week. So I'm going to talk a little bit about just kind of like the facts of this week and then I'm going to tell you guys more of the specifics of my 13th week in this pregnancy. So in week 13, baby is about 2.91 inches and 0.81 ounces. I am using the Bump app. This has been my favorite app that I have found. I've been through probably every single one that you can get for free and the Bump has been my favorite. So by week 13, let's talk about baby first. The baby by week 13 is forming vocal cords and teeth and at this point already has its own little fingerprints which is super cool. Baby's intestines are moving from the umbilical cord to their tummy. His or her head is now about one third of the size of its body. Baby is now forming fingernails. There's a good chance that baby is sucking its thumb in the womb. And yeah, just a lot going on in there for baby. So for mommy, it is perceived to have less fatigue and nausea at this point in pregnancy. I have to agree, my nausea has subsided greatly. I still get it here and there, just depending, but the fatigue i'm not so sure i'm still pretty tired it could have something to do with the fact that i'm not getting a full night's rest because i'm still getting up to go pee i guess maybe it is a little less than what it was from the beginning one of the things that this app says may be expected in week 13 is a little bit of dizziness and it says that is due to progesterone so i could definitely say i have experienced some dizziness all it really takes is for me to like kind of move my head too quick to one side or another and I will experience some dizziness. By week 13, I should be producing some colostrum. It is forming, it is doing what it's gotta do, getting prepared to feed baby, and that makes sense because they have been sore. <laughs> so that is about all the facts. I'm going to talk in these updates as far as my personal experience for that particular week. I'm gonna talk about weight gain, I'm gonna talk about cravings, and that's pretty much it. I'm not gonna go crazy into detail. I will show you guys bumps when there's something to show. Right now it's kind of just fluff. Maybe maybe I'll show something, I don't know. I wore overall so that wasn't really the smartest move on my part, so maybe I won't, I don't know. But believe me when I say, there's not much to show right now. It's just a lot of fluff. I was like this with my son's pregnancy, just more fluffy until about week 17. Okay, so I started this pregnancy out at 150 pounds on the dot. The first few weeks actually ended up losing three pounds due to lack of appetite, and I since then gained that and one pound back. So I'm gonna say I've only had a one pound weight gain as of week 13, just because I'm saying in comparison to like my starting weight, I'm only a one pound um, difference from there. Week 13, definitely no particular cravings. I will say though, the one weird thing that's happened, I guess that's kind of like a craving, is I have taken Tums a few times here and there um, because I am experiencing a little bit of indigestion. And for whatever reason, the Tums to me remind me of the Smarties candies. You guys know what I'm talking about? Whenever I have a Tums, I actually want to eat those. So I don't know if that's a craving. I'm still peeing in the middle of the night, but it's kind of like a shame because it wakes me up and then I'm kind of just like up at that point. It takes me a while to go back to sleep, so that's really frustrating. And other than that, I have noticed some more discharge. Um, nothing crazy, but I've definitely just noticed more. So we're in my son's messy room, <laughs> but this is the bump I'm working with. Like I said, it's mostly fluff. I don't really have quite a bump yet. But it's more just kind of fluffy down there. That's what we're working with right now. So that is pretty much it. I hope you guys are okay with these quick little updates. I wanted to kind of do this weekly instead of bi-weekly. Granted, there's less information, but at least it's just a nice quick video. Short, sweet, to the point, and um, just give you guys an update on week 13. Let's compare and contrast. What week are you in? How was week 13 for you? Are you in week 13? How's it going? Um, let's keep an open discussion in the comments. Let me know how you guys are doing, how you're feeling. I would love to know and talk to you guys. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. Also remember to hit subscribe if you are new. I will be updating you guys on this entire pregnancy, taking you along for the journey, plus vlogging and a lot of fun stuff. So make sure to subscribe if you are new. I hope you're all enjoying your day, night, afternoon, whatever time it is, wherever you are, and I'll see you guys very soon in my next one. Bye.